be here just outside the vehicle assembly building here at the Kennedy Space Center to see the Artemis One rocket, its Orion space capsule, and the mobile launcher leave that building. It's just a truly historic moment. This is the first vehicle capable of lunar space flight that has left that building in 50 years. We've got technology that's been developed for years that is finally getting ready to go fly. And we're going to leave the safety of the Van Allen radiation belts and where the International Space Station is in low Earth orbit. And we're going to go out in deep space. This evening, we are witnessing the rollout of the Artemis One stack. It looks like a skyscraper out there, but that's actually moving on the four mile journey out to launch pad 39B. When this launches to the moon, it will be the most powerful things human beings have ever made. To get all the way 237,000 plus miles to the moon, it's gonna take that beast right there. Rocket launches give people something to look up to. It just lifts our consciousness and our mood. I would love to think that humans are spending more time out in our solar system, around the moon, getting a better understanding of our sun, you know, the center of our solar system, but also getting further away from our home planet, the Earth, and really learning about who we are and what we are and where we are in space. Uh, because there is a lot out there, I believe, that the universe has to teach us. It is just an amazing time to be in the space business. So we're gonna look back in the history books and say that was the moment that things changed. This is our time. We're the art of this generation. And that's what this vehicle represents.